fuck with us Well, we post it every Friday every See Friday. them corner emojis, then you know a nigga wild I'm a jaded Gemini uh, Rihanna is pregnant, y'all My dog did it All the memes I've been seeing is so funny <laughs> He like You did it like, yo, I've been seeing so many. I saw this one meme, and I know you're not going to get it, but all my ladies out there, or, or my girls out there, the or my non berries um, the what? My non binaries, uh -huh. my non binary people, my they thems. True. If you've seen it, you've seen it. You know what I'm talking about with ASAP Rocky, and somebody <laughs> made a statement. They were like, damn. Bro ain't even even packing like that, bro. She just really <laughs> like him for who he is. Like that's the saddest part about no, I definitely it. Definitely don't get that. <laughs> I'm like, bro, that's so. I've, I've never that. seen ASAP Rocky in that way, man. I'm, I was never looking like that, bro. Oh my god. I've never seen that, bro. No, I know you haven't. That's why I had to warm <laughs> that up before I before yeah, I made the that, before bro. I told the hey, joke. Yo. But, <laughs> but hey yo. Yeah, bruh, I guess I guess that was the one that got away for ASAP Rocky and they they made it work. Congrats that, to them. I'm curious congrats. That I know Drake somewhere punching congrats. the air right now. All hating aside, congrats to them. Congrats. congrats. Yeah, it's gonna be amazing. That's gonna be a good No, that's gonna be a very fashionable baby. Nigga, I thought that I was just about to say that's gonna be a good thing for them. They're gonna have a good bonding experience. You're talking about a fashionable baby. Bro, that's gonna be a fashionable. Tell me, that nigga gonna be. They gonna call gonna him Ranch because he gonna be dressing. He gonna be dressing. <laughs> I will say it is really interesting. Um, oh, no. It is really interesting uh, that Rihanna, the makeup mogul, got with the dude that made the colors comment specifically about makeup. That's the only thing that's like really is has the internet on their on their hold, but. I feel like niggas are willing to forget about it because it's them. I don't feel like she's forgetting, but I don't know if y'all, Pete, bro hasn't really been speaking much in the press. I don't think she's allowing him to speak right now. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, she's like, bro, you're a liability. Um, another thing I wanted to mention before we get into this shit is uh, why people didn't think that she was pregnant. Because I feel like people have put pregnancy on rihanna so many times like i pulled up how many times well i pulled up this <laughs> this shit and this was in 2019 this is the last time i remember people like doing it heavy heavy it looked like she put it on herself yeah, yeah but this was about something else and then people just like made it made it a baby and it bro was, she like, literally a posted a baby it was a launch that was like a launch day I, I, well i mean you can't you, it's a cryptic post it means something but bro that didn't look like a baby was on the way bro you know how you bro you know what when i figured that she was pregnant for real was when she took that picture with nikki and kenneth petty and their baby. Oh, the, the big distraction? Yeah, because I was line. like, what are y'all doing? Like, why are y'all over there unless you also have a jit? Like, what What else? What? Why would you be over there? And again, she was wearing baggy shit when she was over there, too. So, I kind of had a feeling, but kind of was in denial still. Cause I was like, damn. I think I she was over there guy. just this guy like fucking that. talking to her about that Victoria's <laughs> Secret shit. And then... She posted no, the, the picture. Tea. Yeah, and I feel like when she posted the picture, she got that flack and was like, I can't fuck with you no more. Yeah, she's like, bro, I'm a businesswoman uh, first, dude. Song. No no hard feelings, but yeah, she bad business right it. now. I gotta cut it. That shit gotta really cut lining it. up with my business model. But yeah, this is this is them, bro. She got her little pregnant belly out and <laughs> shit, you know, doing Somebody. her thing, bro. Drake sliding down the wall. <laughs> you said Drake sliding water. down the wall. Yeah, bro. <laughs> Drake done so followed her. Drake said, bro, I'm not following you no more. I can't yeah. even pretend because she posted, bro, she done posted this shit. He said, I can't even pretend, bro. So we about to get in on Drake. She's glowing. She looks Yeah, bro. She's like, I could finally, right there, I could finally show this off. Well, damn. She is pregnant as fuck. Like, she fine as fuck. Hell yeah. God damn, ASAP. So I want y'all I wanna remind y'all how unhinged Drake is, bro. La like a few <laughs> summers ago in the middle of quarantine, bro, he was in Barbados hanging out with Rihanna family, bro. 
Like, do y'all not see how unhinged and out of pocket this shit is, right? <laughs> He like a power character. My dog like, be sliding. What are you doing? He said, "I'm about to, I'm about to go by, by coastal on y'all niggas, and I'm about to go chill with your uncle." No, seriously, I'm about to go it's chill like with your uncle, baby. it's giving very much like, oh, we're not together, but I'm, I got my own separate relationship with your people, so you can't. Can you blame them though? She I can't blame her up. people because I can't blame her people because it's like who wouldn't want to hang out with Drake? But it's like, bro, it's you Rihanna, Drake, you being bro, creepy, like, bro. I don't blame him for bro. doing that, dog. Because that's like, bro. He And he's at her childhood home. Spotted hanging I, out I with I just love how he, he can mold brother. to whatever environment he's in. Like, look, he looks like a nigga from Barbados. <laughs> right. <laughs> he got the buffs he's on Puerto dude. He's Puerto Rican Drake I know, he's clearly in it, Puerto bro. Puerto Rican Drake. Just on the face. <laughs> Bruh, no, he looking like DJ Khaled. I'm dead. What is he doing? You know what he's doing. Oh, uh, he was he was with some. He was on Rihanna Drive in Barbados signing autographs with a COVID mask on, Spody. Bruh, yeah, bruh, he was out there in COVID. That's crazy. God damn. So I can't blame him. I can't say I blame him, bro. I Honestly. think that's a little unhinged, man. You just popping up at your ex's family shit when they not there. Like, what the fuck? Like, you want to be the fam so bad. And then this resurfaced from 2018 mm-hmm. of him, like, selling out <laughs> about how he wishes that he would have uh, stayed with Rihanna and started a little family and Drake, shit. Drake, like, I should have never made a song with that nigga. What? And it, I don't even remember hearing this interview. Ain't he said his beard was talking lace about right? how Pusha T fucking spilt the beans and shit. And mm-hmm. he was like, yeah, bro, that was a mm. dick move. That's why I had to destroy your bitch you're ass, right, nigga. You're right, you're right. <laughs> and then he had Kanye in the mental institution and yep. shit. Yeah, this nigga, Drake was uh, don't have the fairy tale final like question. Oh, Drake started a family with Rihanna, like, this is, like, so perfect, or, like, you know, Drake, yeah, it's, like, it looks so good on paper. I like, wanted that, too. Uh, what I mean, and I didn't get it, too. By the way, I wanted that, too. Oh, wow. Yep, you heard him correctly. Drake well, said that he wanted to. You wanted that shit, but I guess uh, it was not meant to be. I'm gonna need you to let that shit go. My, I'm gonna need you to let it go, my friend. It wasn't meant to be. It wasn't meant to be. It's all Man, good, bro. I... Hey man, I hope that they have a beautiful, healthy baby, and uh, yeah, I hope, I hope they have a. Ba- shit, I hope man. they have a. Um, That's a hard one to get over, though. A healthy baby too. Somebody like composed like a whole. I'm not about to play this whole fucking thing. Here, I'm gonna show you guys though. Drake, but y'all can go on there. Rihanna, sad face. Yeah, he was like, how how. She lost Rihanna, head ass. Drake yeah. explained how he lost Rihanna. Somebody basically was saying that he was selling out in this song about how he wished he didn't have his son and shit. And I'm like, bro. Who said that? Who said that? I don't think he said that. I don't think bro said that. But y'all can go and watch this damn video if you want. Yeah, look, I I feel like he was just saying it was an unplanned kid. I don't feel like he was saying he wishes he never had him. But this shit is just a whole bunch, a whole lot, a whole lot of mess. Because I didn't even think they were dating, ever. How would somebody find this video? Here, the name is right here. Oh. Hold on. I even... That shit is just called rap. I don't even what the yeah, fuck? I, I, I didn't even realize here, I'm that, gonna bro. Turn they this just off watermark just everything it. so bad. Horribly, but I didn't even realize they took this many pictures together. Like I did not know they were dating, bro. I thought that he was just thirsty for her. I didn't know they were fucking dating. Oh yeah, I definitely can't blame him then. Mm-hmm. I wonder what he did to fuck it up, man. He said he was fucking other bitches. Well, damn, bro. Why? Why? Why would we do that? I don't know. And he talking about he can't imagine her homegirls finding out that he got a bitch pregnant and shit. And I'm just like, bro, you did all this. You literally, this whole thing is just Drake trying to make the world feel guilty about what Drake did to himself. Now he hitting bitches with that Tabasco. He was like, I'd never make this mistake again. Yep. Fucking Louisiana. Texas Pete. Exactly. Papito. 
He talking about girl. I know you're not happy. Boy, bye. <laughs> Drake is hell. Bruh. He had a big stupid ass crib. You see that shit? Right. God damn. Don't tell me to breathe. breathe. I can't. Yo, bring me a shot. <laughs> bring me a shot. Bruh. Is he serious Bruh. or is he joking though? Bring me a shot. Damn, their name is Rap. I was about to say that's. How did you get name. that? It was How much on? did you pay for that? I didn't do it. And then somebody said this shit. Oh my God. If if you if you've seen Twilight before, you'll get this joke. Bruh. I have not seen Twilight in its entirety. They said, what if Drake imprints on Rihanna baby like Jacob did to Renessa May? I so when Bella and Edward had their baby, <laughs> okay. Hi. When they had their baby, yeah. Jacob Taylor Lautner said, I have werewolf powers that makes me have intense emotional feelings for something the first time I look at it. And I saw your baby and I have intense emotional feelings for your baby. That nigga needs to so get now I am in your family for forever. Jail. No, Stephanie Meyer needs to go to fucking jail. Needs she to needs to, to go to fucking jail. So I've always wondered, even yeah, as a bitch. teenager when I was reading those books, I was like, so like, do you want to be like her uncle, her brother, father figure? Yeah, and then I read on and he's like, I'm going to be whatever she want me to be. I'm like, yeah, you're going to have to kill this nigga. Right? You got to kill him because this ain't going to work. Oh, that's a fucked up analogy there, then. Bruh. It's not cool. Bruh. If you've seen the movie, then yeah, bruh. It's fucked, it's fucked up. up, bruh. It's pretty fucked up. But bruh, look at Drake. He already trying to butt into the fucking family, bruh. I mean, but there, there's a difference between that and that. But I, I feel you. There, that That is a little bit much, but... Come on, where's Kamala when you need her? Help. Has anybody seen where the fuck is she? But you know the vice president always in some random fucking place. Right? Let's not get too uh off. We're still on the highlight. No, I don't know. Um, where the fuck is she? Where is but it? yeah, where bro, at? that's pretty much it. Tap um, in. We're gonna hope that Drake keeps his fucking distance, uh, stays blocked, blocks everybody. Um, <laughs> I hope ASAP Rocky keeps quiet especially when it comes to colorism and black lives matter and uh police brutality all that shit just, just shut up <laughs> you funny just shut up fuck, bro. no because he's made statements about all those things like he just needs to shut up and, and just smile and wave and look and look were, nice were um, any of those statements about those things remotely insightful no no nah. no damn all right, bro. I try it for you, dog. He kind of hey. like mirrored Lil Wayne's sentiment. Yeah. Niggas don't realize that. Like, even if that is honestly how you feel, sometimes you're right. It is better to just shut the fuck up. Because <laughs> niggas cannot relate to how you feel a lot of the time. And if you on some real uh, fuck shit, it's going to get magnified. But yeah, man. Have a good, healthy baby, man. Raise the baby, man. Learn oh, from- you already know. They're going to have a, a nice... A nice, uh, taking care of kid. I know, um, but you know, money, more money, more problems, nigga. But what I will say is I hope that Rihanna moves like Beyonce. I hope that if they have any trouble in paradise, that shit, don't, I, don't, I wouldn't take it. I wouldn't take her for, for bringing her shit to the streets, but I don't know. Even though her and ASAP have known each other for a long time, it's like, bro, y'all just, I don't know. I don't know, bro. We only see the outside in. We only see the outside in, you know. Does Rihanna got a hood ass sister that's just like like fighting in elevators? (laughs) Shit. She does have a sister. Oh, damn. ASAP, stay out the elevator. But yeah, we shall see. Wish them the best of luck. Sorry. Nigger guy, a nigger. And then our niggers start saying nigger. I've used the word nigger. Not the word nigger. Say nigger. Word nigger. Say nigger. And you couldn't say nigger. What's nigger? Nigger. My um, That's like 30, 30 times. Solid 30 times. Because I know one of his, his excuses was like, oh, I've been on the air for a long ass time type shit. And it's like, nigger. You said that shit like fucking 50 times, dog. Yeah. And.